Suspense. <laughs> All right. Let's do it. Showdown's pretty good practice. It is, but it's like, I need to be able to practice in game. Otherwise I feel like it's not great practice. And we're seeing double doggy, double doggy. Okay. So I have, I've only faced this a couple of times. But it looks terrifying because it's just going to be like coaching Zamazenta with like <laughs> Zacian just hitting everything on my team for like 90. Uh, and if that's Urshifu water, which I'm pretty sure it is, it's going to be kind of kind of sussy. Let me think. Is there a way to guarantee I get Trick Room off? Uh, of course there is. And it's it's not ideal. Because I want to lead off Incineroar to stop the um, <laughs> to stop the restricteds from breaking my my thing, but I can't guarantee that. Uh, actually, no, this this should work unless it's G-Max Rillaboom, <laughs> which we all know how bad that went last time with the G-Max Rillaboom. Actually, do I want to bring Torkoal? Most of this team is weak to Torkoal. Maybe I do this. I think I'm actually going to leave the Incinera at home for once, and that sounds crazy, but hear me out. It might be, it might be based. All right. And thank you for the follow. FX. Under Zamazenta. Okay. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. I mean, I should always get off Trick Room here, don't I? I'm going to Will-O-Wisp the Samazenta, like, immediately. And I'm, I'm just going to go for the Trick Room. Because I can just get in my, my boy Torkoal. There's the coaching. Terrifying. Terrifying. There's the fly. Alright, I mean, like, I'm cool with that. Did we get Turbo Cali? Turbo Cali's disgusting. <laughs> I hate Turbo Cali so much. Uh, so what's nice about this is the Zamazenta's kind of a non-issue at the moment. Um, I should just be able to self-shadow sneak at this point. And start going for my max quack. Actually, it might be ideal to uh, max mindstorm here, because it makes it much easier to KO this thunderous on the next turn. Let's do it. Actually, it's it's safer to quake. It's it's much safer to quake. Just in case, like, the incineroar comes out, I, I don't want to, I don't want to, like, hit it with a psychic move <laughs> and just miss a turn, you know? By the way, if you guys are watching right now and you want to do a viewer battle, go ahead and just at me in the chat. I'm still getting a, a list of people. Did I just crit myself? No, it just does that much. Zippity zap, thank you for the sub, or for the follow. Probably doesn't one shot, because Amazon is crazy. But uh, we're not in a bad spot. Where's the flight? Is that a mess? Oh, Mimic you, you're crazy, bro. You're crazy. Alright, Zamazent is kind of a non issue, in my opinion. Let's go ahead and go for the Will O Wisp here. And uh, now I'm actually gonna. I mean, I can Steel Spike now. It's probably safe. I don't need to target the Thunders just yet. The reason I'm Steel Spiking the Zamazenta is because it's a guaranteed KO from this range, and I just really don't want to let it get more coachings off. Sup, Marcos? Longtime fan on YouTube. Keep making the great content, my dude. Hey, I appreciate it, CD man. All 
All right. This thing's probably Lumberry. That's just my guess. I guess we'll find out next turn. Well, let's uh, let's make us harder to KO. And I guess we'll see how much this Max Lightning does. I would assume it's a Max Lightning. Yep. Into the Soul Galio. Ooh, that hits really, really hard. Yeah, that explains it. I was going to say, I didn't think it'd do that much, but if it's a crit, I suppose that makes more sense. That was, uh, that was a lot of damage. Rillaboom. Um, I suppose this is still kind of safe. Let's attempt another Will-O-Wisp. I'm fairly certain this is going to be... <laughs> I'm fairly certain this is going to be, um, what's it called? Lumberry, but if we can just go ahead and uh, burn it, that'd be great. Yeah, that makes sense. Just to break the disguise, let's see if we get doubled into. If it's not Lumberry, I'm pretty happy with the outcome of this turn. Alright, don't be Lum. You're definitely Lum, by the way. Unless you're Goggles, that's also like a legit item. Alright, no, it's not Lum. That's great, that's great. It's probably Goggles, then. Goodbye, Rillaboom. And now this Mimikyu is annoying for this Thunderous to KO. This Mimikyu is about to get crazy annoying. Max Knuckle. I don't think that KOs now. No, not after that Steel Spike. Not after a sick, nasty Steel Spike play. Prejudization, right? Yeah. I mean, if we connect a burn on the Zacian, we pretty much just win, I think. Alright. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and attempt a Will-O-Wisp on that Zacian. There's no reason to switch out my, my guy. Uh, let's go ahead and Psychic Fangs the Thunderous for damage. Normally I would go for the double trick room here, but I've done it so often people usually just call it now <laughs> if they're watching my streams. Station protects, that makes sense. Will-O-Wisp goes into that, yep. Psychic Fangs, decent, decent damage. And the Max Lightning. Okay. I think this is still pretty winnable. I just go into my Torkoal here. So they have to make a decision as to which one of these Pokemon they'd like to KO. They can't choose both, and if I get a Trick Room off, I'm in a winning position. So let's go ahead and TR here. And uh, I'll go for my Heat Wave. I could Eruption, but if I, you know, get damaged, then it just doesn't go off. A and the Forfeit. Nice. Alright, good games, Weiss. Playing Pokemon. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, I'm pretty happy. Okay. Ooh, okay. So we see Swordfish. Um, shouldn't be. I mean, the the Dragapult's kind of cool. I'm I'm really hoping it's not Ally Switch. I hate facing Ally Switch Pult. But um, Soggy Dog. Yeah. I'm thinking what I can do is it should be relatively simple to lead off with Mimikyu Torkoal. 
bring so galio in the back and actually get quite a bit out of my palkia this game but i could also make a case for venusaur but palkia is also very good all right can't wait to finish your team when the calcs are complete all right that's all good Okay. This man got the plaid gloves. Holy crap. And that's why I let off Torkoal. Because I always get TR now. Okay. So, I'm thinking we do this. Now that Kyogre's incentivized to kind of just not stay in, I can just get Soul Galeo in for free. I said Soul Galeo like I, like like you were supposed to enunciate Gal. No, it's Soul Galeo. I don't know why I did that. Soul Galeo is another way of saying it. Moxie, want to battle next? Fake memes or not fake memes? I can add you to the list. You'll be right after Moltres, which means you're like second in line. All right. As they Dynamax, that's fine. Since it's in the sun, unless they're like Rain Dance Whimsicott, I should be fine. Do you remember who was here for the last live stream where we battled the Dynamax Whimsicott? That was terrifying. I should tank this by virtue of we are in the sun. Max Hailstorm? I think I still tank that by virtue of I'm a Whimsicott. Or not a Whimsicott. I'm a, I'm a Mimikyu. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm liking this position. Trick Room has been activated. Um... My, my my dopamine glands have been also uh, stimulated. Everything just seems to be uh, going great. Let's click the funny button. Not that button. Not not. <laughs> we're not Dynamaxing a Whimsicott, but uh, a similarly a similarly entertaining button. God, I'm so excited to record this thing. This uh, ad. The runner-up of the Limitless Tournament, Dynamax Whimsicott. Wait, did they actually? Did they actually? Because I'm referring to something that happened to my last live stream. In game three, yo, kind of based, not going to lie. Dynamaxing Whimsicott's kind of based. All right, we should eat like every hit from this Kyogre. Fake tears. I'm sorry, sir. That's not going to work. Nice. Yeah, so Galeo, freaking Full Metal Body is such a good ability, dude. Full Metal Body makes me happy. Max Geyser. This is going to bounce off. I have so much special defense on this, dude. Yeah, that actually just bounced off of me. All right. Uh, we should be able to Quake to KO. And I'm going to get in my, my coal, because there's really no reason not to get him in now.
I love Mimikyu. I actually have a Mimikyu drinking glass. Whenever I have parties, I drink out the Mimikyu glass. Just have a nice little old-fashioned. Just to protect? That's fine. I'm going to eruption next turn. Max guard? No max guard. I suppose it would have gone before the Mimikyu since we're under Trick Room. There's a KO there. DJ Prime, how you doing? That's got to be Dragapult, yeah. Catapultra. <laughs> okay. That was a, I, I'm Mexican and I rolled that R terribly. Catapultra. I, I don't I don't know why I can't do that today. All right. Anyways, Catapult Dragon. Trebufiend, even. Listen, I'm really upset that we got a Catapult Pokemon before we got a Trebuchet Pokemon. Ally switch? I don't think that matters. I guess it kind of does. No, it doesn't because Eruption's going to go first. Alright, I think we win this one. I love Solgaleo so much, dude. Are you guys uh, Solgaleo people or are you Lunala people? Or Big Brain Necrozma people? Ooh, Reginald, how you doing? I like Lunala. Lunala is pretty cool. Psychic Fangs. Cause, or actually, I'm going to Sunsteel Strike for the thumbnail. Matter of fact, I'm going to protect the Torkoal because I really want I really want a thumbnail of me clicking Sunsteel Strike. Ah, okay. No thumbnail for me. GG's, dude. Okay. All right, let's see what we got here. So, ooh, that is a Cherim. That is a Cherim. Okay. Um, do I vibe with this? Yes, yes, I do. Uh, let's go ahead and do. Kind of feeling the. Uh, I'm kind of, I'm kind of feeling the uh, the Incinera in this game. All right, I like this. Dude, I've been facing, like, a ton of Pults lately. <laughs> you think it's okay in this format to build around your non-restricteds? What do you mean? Like, to start off with a non-restricted, then fill in restricteds? I don't suppose it's a bad way to build, but it's, like, an unorthodox way to build. As long as you end up with, the comp with like, a competent team, I suppose it works, you know? But it feels weird to start off. It, it feels like... What what's that saying? Put putting the... Putting the carriage before the horse? Or putting the horse before the carriage? I don't know how it goes. It's like putting cereal and milk down and then putting the bowl up top and like scraping it in. You still end up with a bowl of cereal, but it might be kind of messy. It'll probably taste about the same unless you forgot to wipe off the the uh like the the bleach off like the table, you know? If there's any cleaner on the table, it might make your it might make your cereal a little bit eh.
See, I was looking at Avalog too. I think Avalog isn't bad. Alright. I mean, I should always get off Trick Room here. And... Do I go right into Solgaleo? I don't think I do. I think I might go Palkia. I can go Solgaleo, yeah. Imprison Trick Room, Galar Articuno. Based. Coaching? Alright. So how do I respond? Um I have I have a couple of ideas. Am I gonna Dynamax immediately? Of course I am, guys, of course. It's not a Soul Galio team unless you Dynamax turn two. Uh, this hoe should always lose to Palkia if I keep Palkia healthy in the endgame and get rid of everything around the Ho-Oh. I should also be safe here on my Incineroar since uh, the Ho is just at neutral and uh, there's no chance they go for a fighting move into the Mimikyu slot. And if I get burned, I just stay at neutral with my freaking, uh... <laughs> I literally just stay at neutral with my, uh, with my Solgaleo. And if I don't, then they're gonna have a rough time. Check it out. No burn. Okay, that's fine. We're at neutral. There's the coaching. Should be able to do this now. Go for my parting shot in the ho -Oh. Go for a max steel spike on the Mian Xiao. And now doesn't seem like a horrible time to get in my, uh, my Palkia. Okay, they're Dynamaxing this, which, honestly, I'm cool with that. It makes the... Groudon much easier to deal with in the end. And it actually makes me want to get in my Mimikyu now? Really? Where's the ally switch? Um, I don't... I hate ally switch, but I think I'm fine. Kaizen, thanks for the follow. How much you want to bet this is weakness policy? I mean, I could get in Palkia here, really. like it never happened. And I just heat that up. Awesome. Okay. And I still have a turn of Dynamax, so what I can do here is I can just click a Spatial Rend into this Ho-Oh. And uh, I'll Max Steel Spike the Mian Show again. Regardless, they end up losing something this turn. They withdraw the Mian Xiao, that's fine. Cherum. Yeah, no, that's still fine. I'm still steel spiking. A 
I love Cherim. Nice. So they basically clicked coaching this turn, but they didn't. Because <laughs> Chirim is basically a coaching boost. Nice. That did nothing. Alright, uh, I still have another turn to do stuff. Here, I'm actually going to choose to get my Solgaleo off the field. And I'm going to Spatial Ren this Cherim. So Galio can be used more as just a way to pick off the Mian Xiao later on. I want to make sure that this uh, Ho isn't annoying. Helping Hand, I should eat that pretty well. Because that's basically neutral. So as long as I don't miss here, we got nothing to fear. Awesome. Push the mentions to turn to normal. That's fine. There's the Dragapult, so no Groudon. That's phenomenal news for your boy. Let's do this. I can get my Solgaleo in on the field here. And I can Parting Shot this thing. No need to fake out. The Dragon Darts. As I say, I can't help but feel like Solgaleo eats that. Same to Sin. And I should be able to get off a Trick Room now. Mimikyu is just going to be the MVP of this game. Dragon Darts tells me pretty much all I need to know. Uh, I suppose we just Sunsteel Strike here for damage. And we'll Trick Room here. Phantom Force, I figured. Sacred Fire. Oh, that burn kind of sucks. I forgot that it could burn through disguise. But really, I just need that trick room. Alright. So, Galio, you can go away now. <laughs> I'll go ahead and... I should be able to get in Palkia for free now. I think the sun just went away. Did it? I wasn't paying attention. I'm an idiot. Just gonna put that out there. I'm a little dumb. Yeah, sun went away, so I can start clicking Hydro Pump. Alternatively, I could just annihilate <laughs> the Dragapult when it comes back out, but uh, Hydro Pump seems pretty safe. And I'll just go ahead and get in my Incin. You know, Newt, I've been looking into a Lola Marowak. I think it could be pretty decent. Alright, that's fine. As long as we get rid of the Mian Xiao here, I'm happy with the end of this turn. 
I swear, we have never landed a Hydro Pump with this Pokemon. Anyone who's been watching the streams, can you can you attest to that? Have we ever landed a Hydro Pump with this thing? Anyways, I suppose it doesn't matter. We just spatial rend here. And uh, I don't even need to fake out, technically, in case they don't. But I should fake out since under Trick Room, ours will go first. If this is Sash Dragapult, we're kind of in trouble. But if it's not, we just win. Is there any better TR setter than Mimikyu? I would say Mimikyu is the best non-restricted TR setter right now, but Porygon 2 gives it a run for its money, to be honest. Yeah, like like Lizzie, like um, Mimikyu with a Mental Herb is just so, so reliable. It's crazy. All right, I'll do this. Make this a little bit easier on myself. Just to make sure I don't take too much damage here. That's fine. It likely doesn't have Roost, so... This is still fine. I can just start clicking like Shadow Sneak. Actually, I think Play Rough might be fine... It's, it's similar damage, since it's resisted, and I also have the chance for an attack drop. Alright, I might get Brave Bird crit here. Just gonna put that out there. But I should be fine. Uh, I, mean, I mean, I have a lot of physical defense on this Palk. Attack drop. Not quite. Sacred Fire, that's fine. Twisted Dimensions return to normal. There's really no reason to reset the Trick Room, in my opinion. But I'm gonna. <laughs> Alright, so that's another Intimidate, just to make sure this thing isn't really doing too much to us. It's a Sacred Fire. Probably into the Incen. Oh no, into the Palky again. Is this thing Choice Banded? Is that, is that a possibility here? Alright, anyways. Uh, no, it's not, because it protected. We just Fake Out. Um, I'm going to click Spatial Rend this turn in case they protect. Because I only have three Hydro Pumps, and if I miss all of them, it would really suck. Anyways, now I can click Hydro Pump. And Parting Shot again. Alright, hopefully I connect. I have not landed one of these with this team yet. And Hydro Pump isn't even like a terribly inaccurate move. <laughs> It just seems to matter more when you want to hit it. Recover, that's fine. I didn't realize I was faster than this thing. Yep, still not gonna land it. <laughs> I only have so many more of those. Also, it just revealed that it has access to recover. So I'm going to Spatial Rend. What do you think of Dialga with a Life Orb? Um, It's probably fine. I think that if there's anything you do run Weakness Policy on, it's probably Dialga. Okay, 
I'm going to reverse the Trick Room now, because I think there's still one more turn on it. Right? And this will allow me... I mean, Trick Room ends anyways. <laughs> it doesn't really matter. I just attack. Play Rough is technically better. And uh, I'll go for the Hydro Pump. This will allow me to go for two Hydro Pumps in a row. All right, it's below half. Connect the Hydro Pump. Connect it. Please. I don't want to get PP stalled. Actually, no, I, I don't get PP stalled because it's not pressure. All right, KO. Oh, no. Now I click Spatial Rend every time because it's within range. I Shadow Sneak and I Spatial Rend, and there is no other combination of moves I click. Shadow Sneak, and I'm faster, so Spatial Rend. That's fine. I listen, if I miss this spatial rend, I'm gonna cry. It's it's five percent chance to miss. Oh, I have to click hydro pump. Dang it. Come on, Palkia, I need you to not miss here. Critical hit? That's great. Okay, there we go. That was... Oh, that was horrible. That was horrible. <laughs> Is there a line for battles? Uh, the stream ends, like, right now. Because it's over 7.30 now. But yeah, uh, that's going to be it for tonight's stream, guys. Thank you all for coming out.